There's simply nothing like the Texas-Mexico border. It's wide open, it's vast, it's a dynamic part of our state and our national economy. But there is a crisis that's occurring today. We have drug cartels that are chasing farmers and ranchers off their land. We have illegal immigration into our country that is literally flooding our law enforcement trying to keep up with uh, this occurrence. And I thought it was essential for our agricultural leaders uh, in other states to see firsthand exactly what's occurring because there's no substitute for seeing it with your own eyes. We saw the McAllen substation that is literally being overrun, excess capacity over three times of what it was designed to do in terms of housing those that are coming into our country illegally. The message in that information has to get to Washington, D.C. that we cannot play games about border security. We cannot falsely proclaim that the border is safer than ever when we see uh, border Patrol stations being overrun with those who have been entering illegally, being apprehended, when we see the wide open spaces that are having to be defended. We also saw firsthand uh, how illegal contraband and narcotics is being smuggled into our country through these legal trade mechanisms. Uh, our Border Patrol, uh, our Department of Public Safety, and our local law enforcement officials. It's amazing the job that they're doing, but we know that they're outgunned, they're outfunded because the drug wars are yielding such profits. Uh, and uh, they need help. It is my desire that people from all across our 50 states uh, recognize that, yes, this southern border is a long way from home, but they are living with the consequences of a broken system. It is my hope that leaders will step forward. They will challenge their congressional delegation. They will go to their United States senators and say, we need action today. I think NASDA members are in a unique position, and I hope that we'll band together that we'll share this information for those that were unable to join us uh, and to send that message that we have a great nation that's worth fighting for and these problems can be fixed if we all come together.